hello Victoria here with you all right as I promised we're gonna do reading about his feelings what he feeling about you the card jumping up the feelings totally there absolutely there and they're getting bigger and stronger but for some reason he's hiding them okay let's see who came let's see what spirit came a little bit about him so you can understand if it's resonate with you or not Okay, Mr. Lover Lover, an empty card. So, man who's in love, the man who very romantic and um, he probably have a dark hair. Man with a very soft and romantic nature who make the choice already. Let's see a bit more because why he give us, he's, you know, he's very sharp. Like I said, and it's it. Do not ask me again. Let's see a bit more. Tell me about yourself. All right, he's giving me two kings. He's saying, I'm really down to earth. You say I'm romantic, but I'm not really. I know where I am. I know what's going on. And, and I am very sharp. And there is a woman who probably a bit older than me. I have feelings for. He bring you up straight away. He said that you possible that you possible that you married or you taken. If you not married or taken, you are simply the woman of his dreams, the woman who will be in his eyes perfect as a mother, perfect as a wife. He's jumping straight into it. Yes, he said, I'm normally walking through life with my head uh, high. And uh, no, if I want something, nothing will stop me. And I will fight till the end. Yeah, he said, I will fight till I found this special lady who I can create family with. But he said, I didn't found her so far. He said that you disappoint him somehow, that he thought one thing, but it's turned out to be something else. He said things change between us. He absolutely have feelings for you. He said, yes, feelings absolutely there. Feelings are strong. Can I feel like... I showing him, showing those feelings to her, not necessary that he say, I love you or something else, but he said, I show that to her, I show my attention, I show my intentions, I showed my feelings already, so she probably didn't understand. <laughs> Connection is very deep. Connection is very strong and you, you can't, you can't change it. This is something what... Uh, get stronger night time and um, he getting a bit more romantic over the night time um, but those feelings his experience is very new for him he said I did not been like that for a very long time or never been like that at all um, he said already to to be like a wolf, you know, hail on the wall, on the moon, like, oh my God, I'm, I want to be with her, I miss her. But he said that something was between you, which totally broke his heart. Because it's general reading and everyone have his own story. Think about it. What was that? Mm. Now he feel a bit down. He's missing you. He's missing you, but... His motivation uh, went down to zero. If before he was, yeah, I'm gonna go and get it, nothing will stop me. Now he's a bit, mm. yeah, now he's like a hanging man. He, he have idea, but he's not doing nothing to follow that idea. Okay, what happened? He said, right. First of all, he's taken. 
ki, as I ask what happened, he said, I'm taken, or you taken, one of you. And um, this is the biggest problem, or both of you taken. So this is the biggest problem. He said, I can't believe we met for a reason. He said, it can't be. He's he trying to look on other girls. He trying, but he's failing. He said, every time it broke, brought me back to you. Every time when I try change my mind and concentrate on something else, something brought me back to you. So connection is very strong and he tried to resist from that connection, try and make the plans to do something else and kind of live his life different or change his lifestyle. But you do have this sexual energy around you, which connect with his one. Maybe you both fiery people and uh, sexually open and... It's like something about her what make me crazy and this is on sexual level it's not on romantic he does have feelings for you but what him always drag back to you this is this strong sexual connection he absolutely love you like I said 100 percent i love this woman he said if we're talking about sexual desire, my feelings towards her, this is Ice of Cup. But my sexual desire towards her, this is Pasha of Winds. So, his romantic feelings towards you much greater than sexual desire. But sexual desire is huge. So, imagine, sexual desire always brought him back to you. But times is by 10, this is his romantic feelings towards you. But romantic feelings, he can control, he can cuddle up, close up, and that's it. Like, you don't see me, I don't see you, it's gonna finish soon. But sexual desires, this is something what he cannot control. And this would bring him back to you all the time. So when you think about, do a bit of... Um, lady chicken stuff uh, when you use your woman by wis wisdom remember you can't play with his feelings romantic feelings because he can control it but you can play with sex his sexual feelings so you can seduce him a little bit you can open up more you know you can do something what we girls know how to do to get to him faster because this what he cannot control this what you can kind of pull and push a little bit but do not do this with romantic feelings because romantic feelings he said i can't control I, he just closed up and that's it you're not gonna see him again if you're gonna push to that all right i think i explained it right He helping his family financially. Uh, he has um, some kind of responsibility. It could be family as his wife, or it could be family like parents or uncles and so on. Because he said, I have those responsibilities. I have to help them, but I don't really want it to. So his kind of responsibility are there, but I don't really want to fulfill those responsibilities he said normally i'm a very strong person i can control everything i can work i can love i can cut someone off i can do whatever i'm a very strong person but when with you and you have something about you he said i'm turned up to be so soft 
I'm such a softy. I don't know what's going on with me. He said, I'm not like that. It's not me. I'm not recognizing myself in that person. Yeah, he feel like a fool sometimes. He say, I'm doing things which make me look back on it and thinking, oh my God, what, what have I done? Why have I done it? Especially when he say you something, sometimes he understand he should not said that. It was too much or it was not enough. Um, he block you. If he didn't, he will. He said, I want to stop that. I want to stop this connection. I want to stop that progress and kind of keep each other on a distance. So we see each other. Or maybe he's seeing your account or something, but not interfering. What is the problem? Why he's so afraid of? He said before one of you could be taken, but let's see why he's afraid of this interaction so much. All right, um, he said, because it's affecting his business mind. It's affecting the way he's um, outside of this relationship. It's affecting how he, um, how much spend, time he spent at work, uh, how concentrated he is in work and stuff like that. He said... <laughs> He wants something light. He, some, he wants something with uh, lots of sex, but not, no, not a lot of responsibilities. He said, I think you put the spell on me somewhere. There is something not right with me. There is some magic influence what affected me. And uh, he said, I'm waiting. I want to see if this is the case or this is natural. But he said, when you start staying away, this when he's, you know, the sexual interest waking up, what I mentioned previously, when all this desire jumping back and forward. So, um, maybe for you to stay away, this is a good idea. This is how you should be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep yourself to yourself. Continue with your life and it's working as a provocation for him. It's working very well. He has so much um, jealousy of what you he he je you you stood by the by the tree, he he think right, something going on between them. <laughs> so it's going to the point when he feel he's going crazy. And it's not good, ladies. Those aren't the thing like, oh my God, it's cool. No, it's not good. Because when person losing control, it's never good. It's always something in it. He does have feelings. He keep repeating, I do love her and she does make me feel happy. But that lack of control, it's really working on him, really working against him and against you as well and your relationship. So play cool <laughs> and let him boil in those emotions and come up with something. Let him be a man. If you would like to have private reading, please visit my website, what will be showing on the screen. And uh, I will pu put my magic services on my website. I keep promising, but it's so much work. I keep putting it away. But just ask me what you need and we'll sort it out. 
All right, ladies. Love you and leave you. Thank you.